guys, it's Lego Show TV here, this time doing my second Lego Ninja Scalebound set review. And this time we're taking a look at 70602, ages 7 to 14. This is Jay's Elemental Dragon. And yes, this is from Amazon.co.uk. It's the second uh, set I got. Or actually was going to be, it's actually probably the first one that I was mainly going to order. But as you can see, comes with Jay, Monkey Wretch, and Cyrus there. And uh, then you can see the front of the box with Jay there and the Scatbound um, flag. And then Join Woo Crew, Monkey Wretch, Siren, Jim Blade, Trapping Nia, Jay, and extra size of Jay there. And then the features of set. So now let's take a look at the instructions. And here they are, but we mainly want to take a look at the second one because it has what we want to see in it. And uh, get the peace camp and the Skybound poster there, at least one of them. And uh, I have reviewed Tiger Widow Island. At the end of February, early March, I will be getting Cole's Dragon, Ninja Bike to Sky Shark. Raid Zeppelin and Misfortune's Keep. And then the other Scabon poster and uh, the end of the build there and the features of set. Now, see any instructions? Let's take a look at those minifigures. I am also including with the minifigures the little thing for uh, Siren and uh, the Jim Blade. And uh, here's a good look at the Gen Blade. And uh, you do get an extra one of the little uh, um, stud type pieces there. Or whatever those pieces are there, printed tiles. And then you get this um, elemental blade piece in this translucent kind of watery color looking ice color there. And uh, yeah, overall cool design. I really like it. And uh, here's Skybound, or here's the little uh, thing for uh, uh, Siren there. Oh, this is a stick shot shooter. I'm not going to shoot these. But um, Monkey Ratch here um, can uh, clip on to it. And yeah, you can clip on with his tail. Or, uh, yeah, and yeah, and then clip on like that, and uh, yeah, so get it off there. But all it is is for Siren um, to uh, fly against the elemental dragon, and it does have a wrench, and there's some two stickers there, and these can't move. Got two pirate cutlasses there. I really like those pirate cutlasses. And uh, yeah, um, let's take a look at Siren real quick. Um, you can see her torso detailing, light detailing, same little print, um, same face as the pirate from the Pirates Island in 2015, and Black Widow's hair in black. And then you've got the um, other version of the sword holder, and uh, yeah, uh, you can see her back torso detailing and back head detailing. There's a good, another good look at her um, printing in front there. Next up is Monkey Ratch, and uh, you can see he's just a robot monkey like the one in the show. He is the one in the show that um, likes to be the mechanic. And I think this mold is pretty cool. Never had like a monkey before. And yeah. Um, and then last, not least, but the best, Air Jitsu Robe, Jay. And uh, uh, you can see he has torso detailing and leg detailing. Same deep stone head or a mask. And it's the same deep stone legs. Different um, 
face or the same 2011 face that comes in the um, other sets like normal and not Miss Fortune's Keep that has the App Patch one. App Patch J in it. And then the back torso detail. And uh, yeah, that's about it for the minifigures and accessories. And uh, yeah, pretty cool minifigures. And uh, yeah, now let's get on to the actual dragon itself. Here is the elemental dragon for Jay. And uh, looks pretty epic there. And uh, the face, start off with that. Um, has movement in the uh, um, head with the mixel type joints and uh, the neck is on ratchet joints can move it to some degree and what's really disappointing is where these um, spring-loaded missiles are you can't move them at all you can only move the top parts and uh, that is disappointing. I do like the way the wings are designed there. Um, like electricity is going through them. Nice using the elemental blades. And uh, yeah. But that's really disappointing with uh, no like articulation or movement in there. And uh, do got room to put J. And uh, it's pretty cool. And you can put the reins in there. Get them. Yeah. You can kind of get them to fit. But, um, yeah. They don't fit that. Um, it's harder to get them to fit. Yeah. Yeah, that's getting them harder to fit there. Um, each of the legs have articulation and uh, they're all ratchet joints. And the tail is really good. It can move. And yeah, there's a look at the top there. And the spring loaded missiles, you just touch like that. And catch it. But you just tap the end. And it comes out, and it's this transy darkish blue color. And uh, yeah, there are some printed tiles that are from the Air Jitsu J um, set. And uh, yeah, you do have on the back, which I don't know why that's in there, like this. But um, yeah, uh, there's a blow dart there and two flintlock pistols yeah um, and on the face uh, you can open it up you can open the mouth up and that's Meryl Beard's beard in a dark bluish color it's cool and uh, these horns are really not needed but if you do if you do uh, take them off it looks kind of awkward but um, but yeah, I get that they're for detailing, but uh, they could have been not even put in this app, but that would make it look totally weird. But um, yeah, uh, that's about it for this set. And uh, yeah, pretty cool set and all. And I totally like it. Glad I got it, and uh, one of my favorites of the wave because it's a dragon, and of course, yeah. Um, I would have to rank this probably at my uh, fourth favorite. My first favorite kind of being the Ninja Bite Chase, but um, and Tiger Whale Island second. But um, yeah, lots of ratings.
set. On to the ratings for the set. I believe this set in the United States retails for about $25. Uh, I don't really know how much it was um, on Amazon.co.uk, but I'm very glad I got this. Um, but um, I don't like that uh, it doesn't have no, any articulation in the main bits of the wings. You could probably fix that, but um, it would take some modifying to do so. And, um, yeah, I really don't like that at all. And, uh, yeah, I also found it, uh, harder to, um, put these reins in a little bit. But, uh, yeah, um, it's a really big thing. And these horns are not really, um, uh, could, could be a, totally avoided there. But, um, like the minifigures, and, uh, yeah, um, pretty cool, uh, set. And, uh, they could have done better on the wings, I just think. And this is a little bit smaller than I expected. And, uh, but, yeah. Overall, I am going to give this set a total rating of a 9. Because I just feel like that it could have been a little bit better with the wings. And, uh, I think that instead of Monkey Wretch, they should have put, like, another ninja and another pirate in it. But, um, yeah. Uh, that's about it. That's all I have to say, so please comment, subscribe, check out my Twitter at LegoShowTV1, and I will see you next time. Bye!